I show you a very so short video, small video, how to make the settings with this Bose Lifestyle 18 as a preamplifier. Because I like this thing, this device, because you have a lot of options. Well, if you use it for for settings, you need to do settings. This cable in the bottom is gonna go to the TV, connect to the TV, and here we have the Bose remote control, and you go to system, settings, and you set up everything the way you need it. But if you want, don't want to use the Bose as your DVD, so you're gonna plug your DVD right here, in the top over here, and you go to exit, you hit exit over here, and if you see, this is a Denon, you see the, TV, the Denon is on the TV, and this is the Denon DVD right here. Yeah, so you can use also other devices on this Bose system. Well, I'm gonna, in this video I'll show you few options. Well, the option is important for me. Well, you can see what's going on in the back. You have plenty of places to plug this, this Bose lifestyle. As you see, you can use it for a pre-amplifier. You see, this is audio out. You can use many inputs as you want, yeah? You have the RCA inputs, you have optical inputs, and this thing is also a radio. The one thing that I really like about this system, this remote control is passing the walls. Yeah, you can be in totally different part of the house and this remote control not, you know, is very easy to use. You can be three, three rooms far away from the system and you don't need a direct connection with the system, but this thing is passing the wall, many walls, so you can have very nice control on the system from totally different place in the house. Well, and this is the uh, optical in and out. As you see, they have a tuner over here as well. The part over here is the white one, is the acoustimus system, yeah? The one that is same main. This is going to the acoustimus subwoofer. And the one in the bottom is going to the Bose amplifiers. Well, um, today I'm gonna make only the short video how to operate this system with the, as a pre-amplifier. So I'm gonna show you very shortly. Anyways, yeah, I plug this Bose system right now. Let me use the auxiliary, one second. I use the auxiliary. Okay, I plug this thing, these two cables, the audio cables to my entire system over there. And from there it will go it will go to the Denon receiver in the bottom. Okay, let me see. Later I'm gonna do another video for this subwoofer because I have the little uh, acoustic speakers and I show you later on how to plug it. I mean, it's very simple. I'm not sure that I need to do video like that. But anyway, right now I'm making only this, this Bose lifestyle, this little fin over there, how it operate as a preamplifier. If you see, I change it, the inputs, yeah, I change in the inputs, for example, something else, there's no sound anymore. So I'm going to the auxiliary, where I plug my Bluetooth device. And from here, it's going over there. If you see, I'm taking this thing down. And from here to here, you see, I'm taking the volume down, nothing anymore. And from here, it's going down there, and from there, it's going to here. So this is a short video how to use the Bose Lifestyle as a preamplifier for any device that you want to use. Well, because you have so many options over here, so this device can be very nice also for people who don't have the little Bose cubes or want to use other Bose device. As you see, it's very practical and you have a good advantage. 